Hey guys! So, recently, we've been getting a lot of requests on people wanting to download the More Players model for Minecraft, and since you guys have been requesting it so much, I decided that I'll make a quick tutorial for you guys on how you can download it. First off, if you don't know what the More Players model is, it is a mod in Minecraft where you can edit your character to have, as the name says, more models than are actually in Minecraft. On our server, catscraft.net, if you log on with the more players model, you can see other players with the mod and you can see what they're changing their skin to look like. So here are some things that you can use to change your skin. You can have a beard, ears, hair. Here's an example, you can change the color of it. I'll just do that. And then you can see that behind me. But I'm not gonna leave that. Anyways, that's just an example of something that you can do with the more players model, but there's many other things that you can do other than that. And since we use the more players model for our music videos, and you all wanted to know how to do it, here's the tutorial. First up, what you want to do is you'll want to have Forge installed for your Minecraft. And here's the website where you can actually download Forge if you don't have it already. Download whichever version of Forge you'll be using corresponding to the Minecraft version that you'll be using. So if you'll use 1.8, then download that version of Forge for whichever version you'll be using. I would suggest getting it from this website so that you make sure that you don't get any viruses getting it from the wrong one. Once you download Forge, then you'll want to actually install it and set it up. You can do that by double clicking it on wherever you sent it to. I would send it to the desktop just so that I can find it easy. Make sure that you have Minecraft closed while you're installing this and run the Forge installer, select Install Client and press OK. After you do that, then you can locate your Minecraft.net folder. Usually for people, that would be in the, if you're using Windows, then in the Windows start menu, you would type in percent app data percent, and you need to go through your folders to find the Minecraft folder. If you do not already have a mods folder in your .minecraft folder, then you may need to create one. Make sure that you type it exactly the same though so that it actually works as the folder. Then download the more players model. This is the website that you can download the npm mod from. It will probably send you to AdFly, so if it does, just wait the few seconds until it'll show the skip button and then just press skip so that then you can go and get the NPM mod. Place the jar for it inside of the mods folder, which will be inside your .minecraft folder. After that is placed in your .minecraft folder, open up the launcher and click launch options. Once you go there, click add new, then click the drop down arrow after that and scroll till you see the version of Forge that you've installed. Select that one, press save, you can give it a name if you would like, go to news, click the next arrow, then select that version of Forge so that you'll be logging on using that one. Make sure that the version of npm that you downloaded is the same Minecraft version that you downloaded for Forge or else it won't work. Also make sure that you don't have two versions of the npm mod in your folder for it or else that won't work either and Minecraft just won't load so don't do that.
now that you installed the more players model mod, then you can test this out on our server so that you can see other players that may be using the mod. Open up Minecraft and then type in catscraft.net and log on to the server. Then by pressing F12, you should get all these options here of how you can change your skin. It's really easy to actually get a skirt, just click skirt and then you can go through none, normal, click through the colors. It's really easy to change. And if you want to take it off, you can just do that to take it off. So there you go. You should have the more players model working and everything should all be set up. If you have any questions, then feel free to comment them down below. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye!